Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do your daily vibes for around the 30th. So we're just going to see what comes up. The timing is fluid, and this reading may or may not be for you. This reading is not sign specific, and it is not time specific. So we're just going to see what comes up. What do we have for around the 30th? Around the 30th. King of Wands reverse. And the King of Wands reverse, somebody that is unreasonable. Self centered, perhaps. Egotistical. Five of Cups reversed. <sighs> Page of Cups reversed. So this could be a, like um, emo a very emotional time. Uh, extremely emotional with the page of cups and the five of cups reverse there's some been some sort of loss could be moving on could be uh, uh, forgiveness even but pro or prolonged grief this page this is like really 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 sad so somebody isn't happy by the looks of things um, there could be a rejection here. Somebody could be being rejected, which could make somebody very upset. That's somebody getting very upset. Um, there could even be a split or a breakup with these two cards. Uh, Page of Pentacles going down a new path. This person may get very mad. They can't, and it doesn't matter what sign it is, but this is an individual who may get very, very upset over a situation that they are not... Um, in love with you know they're not in love with it there's a new opportunity here there's an opportunity to go through a new doorway they've manifested something new uh, this is a new enterprise and an and, um, opportunity to start fresh it's not going to be easy but there's definitely a golden opportunity it's a big one too it could lead to something permanent long term stable um, but there's probably a need to to let go of something that was hurting them or did hurt them with the five of cups an unrequited love situation to go down this new path interesting the page of pentacles is setting goals laying new foundations uh, putting in effort, very determined to start fresh, to start over. Um, this could even be an apology, which is interesting. Strength. Now this is a card of courage and determination and willpower again. High Priestess reversed. Somebody could be choosing to be single, or we could have somebody that has some um, ill intentions, put it that way. Somebody may be trying to assert their power or their control over another person, you know, very uh, deceptively, sneakily. So we have somebody here that may be very sneaky, may have some sort of uh, power over another person, and they love the power that they have. Interesting. Ah, night of... I feel like we have an individual that is trying to prevent, trying to pre prevent another person from moving forward. This Knight of Wands reversed is, is, is not, don't go, something like that. But the Knight of Wands reversed is, can also be a troublemaker. This is somebody that's a troublemaker. This is somebody that has a chip on their shoulder that, uh... Really, we have somebody here that really likes to be in control. We, we really, really, really do. This person really likes to be in control. They may be losing control, so now they're asserting some sort of power to regain control. Um, now, moving too fast. Not aware. There's a lack of spirituality, a lack of awareness here with the High Priestess reverse. We could have a a feminine per se that ha doesn't have a lot of female friends this person um i 
has a chip on their shoulder and doesn't like to lose control. Interesting. Interesting. <laughs> now this is taking action. Shedding the old to bring in the new. Willing to let go of the old to bring in the new. Willing to do whatever it takes to bring success. Nine of Pentacles. We have a very self-sufficient, independent person who knows their value. This person is very sexy, curvy, um, by the looks of things. Has it all, is very comfortably set. But they may be dealing with an individual who is clueless. This person may be clueless right here. We have a very strong, independent person who has built themselves up. Very earthy, very grounded with these colors and this the very grounded energy. So that we have a we have a opportunity for success for comfort, for permanence. But it's going to take a lot of strength and willpower and courage and determination to let go of the old to bring in the new. And there is somebody around in this scenario that is causing, we have a troublemaker. We have a troublemaker. We have somebody here that is causing problems. This person lacks friends, is probably very shallow, lacks morals, doesn't have very good morals acts impulsively hmm. this person right here is enjoying the finer things in life ah nine of wands setting boundaries we have an individual that is setting boundaries protecting themselves has been has fought a lot has fought a hard life had a hard battle so this person is protecting themselves so we have an individual here that is very strong has gained a lot of self-worth okay a lot of self-value and is now protecting themselves from getting run over forget from getting hurt again a lot of determination here, determined to um, not get hurt again, determined to protect themselves. This is manifestation and this one is too. So somebody has manifested a new beginning with somebody that is very graceful, somebody that is very kind and generous and has a lot to offer. But there's a, there's like a, there's a troublemaker involved here. There's somebody that is causing trouble. The page of cups reversed is somebody that is insincere. Could be dealing with a drama queen. It could be. We could have a drama queen right here that is causing problems because they're being let go. Because this is shedding the old, bringing the new. Whoever, whoever that they were that they separated from, they're grieving from, and they may be, you know, wanting another chance. This is taking action. This is taking action to bring success. We have like a divine connection here. This is like somebody has called in a... Uh, something they have called in they've manifested a new opportunity and now they have to find their strength and determination to i feel like with the five of cups to be wise and let go of something hmm. five of pentacles reversed unhealthy relationship 
somebody was neglected and, and ghosted by another person. And it feels like now they're popping up. They're popping up from underneath the surface. They're popping back up. They're popping back up. They're going to, it's like they're apologizing or they want another chance. And I think that they want another chance because maybe they see that somebody has another opportunity. I mean, this is, this is building a new foundation. Yeah, all isn't fair. It's not fair. It's not fair. Somebody may be saying it's not fair. Something isn't turned out in their favor. There's an imbalance here. Somebody isn't being honest. This is they're not being honest. Somebody is not being honest. They're uh, leading somebody into danger. Okay, this is dangerous. And this person is naive. The King of Wands in reverse is naive. So we have a naive, and this could be anybody, anybody's energy. We have an individual here that is naive. They are uh, being unrealistic or uh, just can't see. There's no vision. There's a lack of foresight. They can't see that whoever is, is uh, that left them, that left them, only wants power and control because that's what strength is which is interesting but this is taking action to shed the old to to bring in to to start over with the new somebody is letting go of the old they are they are realizing that they have something new with the five of cups reverse they've they've held that maybe this has something to do with three years maybe this has been going on for three years but this is this is letting go of the old and accepting the new yeah, it is what it is. We have an individual here that's not happy with the outcome and they're being dishonest and they're being secretive, very secretive. And they're trying, it feels like they're trying to manipulate a situation. They are, they're trying to manipulate a situation. But I don't think it's going to turn out in their favor. I don't. This one's expecting trouble. Nine of Wands, on guard, on duty, on the lookout. So we have a very um, strong, very strong individual here. Strong, strong, strong. Very strong individual who has fought their whole life and has learned has a lot of life experience this person has gained strength through life experience and they they've got a troublemaker behind their back that is up to no good we have an emperor here who is going to be making a decision he is ready to fight he is going to take action he is going to take action. He is all about stability. He is all about security and doing what's right. So this guy may have been in the military. He is a protector. He is a protector. He knows what he wants. I feel like he is making a very... Obviously, it's a tough decision. I think he is making a tough decision. Um, I think he knows what he has to do. Uh, he's going to be taking action to go down that new path. He's going to be offering something solid. He is ready. He's ready. He's ready. Um, very wise individual. He's focusing on the future. There's a divine connection here as well. He sees something as being a divine connection. He also sees that there is... Uh, you know, there's no resolution. There's no resolution for the one that 
ghosted him or neglected him or didn't take care of him or whatever the case is. Uh, this emperor is making a decision. He's a fighter. He's taking control. He's going to take control. Now, these, these are both self-mastery. So this guy's master. He is. He's a master. He masters his emotions very well. So he's going to be taking action to lay a new foundation to start fresh. He's opening up. He's going to be sharing. He's giving. He's ready to move forward. He's ready to move forward. He's ready to move forward from an unjust situation where... You know, he wasn't treated fairly. He wasn't treated fairly by an individual. And I think this this individual that did not treat him fairly is trying to regain control, trying to assert their power or something to uh, manipulate this person, which is interesting. There's definitely some manipulation here. But this is opening up. Somebody is going to be opening up. Definitely going to take charge. We have an individual here that is very much aware that they are being... It feels like bamboozled, you know? That's what it feels like. Very much aware. But this one is naive. The King of Wands in reverse is naive. So this, this person may get upset. They may get upset. Uh, maybe they come to some sort of realization. You know, they come to some sort of realization that whoever is playing with them is actually playing with them. And they decide to reject. This is insincere. I'm going down the new path. I'm building a new foundation. Taking action. I know what I want. I want something stable, solid, and secure. Um... They're definitely letting go of something, letting go of something or somebody that did not do them justice. Okay, they didn't uh, do the right thing. There was a lack of integrity here. They're letting go of that situation. We, this person is very experienced, very wise. And knows that they have a golden opportunity for something permanent with an individual that can really give. You see, there's six re really give to them where there can be equal reciprocation, where it can actually grow. This is somebody has manifested a new opportunity, and now that they have it, they have something or somebody that um, didn't take care of them that is causing problems. It's a troublemaker right here. Looks like it's a fire sign, an Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius. Doesn't have to be. Um, one more card. Setting boundaries, pushing somebody away. Somebody's being pushed away. Taking back control, taking control, severing ties, cutting the strings. The devil reversed, severing ties. Somebody is deciding to sever ties with an unhealthy relationship that they were bound to. It's breaking that bond. This guy is, or a person, is deciding that... I feel like they want something stable. They want the new... They want the new opportunity. And the only way to have the new opportunity is to let go of the unjust situation completely. So, um, there could be some sort of uh, fight or battle or conflict here that causes this release. Okay, because there is a release here. This is breaking free from something that is toxic and unhealthy. So there is a uh, finding the strength and the determination to uh, let go 
of the old to bring in the new. So somebody is being released. There could be a, there's a rejection or a separation or a goodbye. I don't even need the Eight of Cups. Somebody wasn't treated fairly in the past. They were uh, neglected. And it feels like the person that neglected them is, remember we've been talking about coming back around, coming back around. This person is coming back around. This person that is coming back around is getting um, told. Sorry, but I'm going down the new path. I'm building a new foundation. I'm going with the new. Good luck.